So there's a buck right there. Munching away. He's having his breakfast while we have ours. Right where we're boondocking. Hello, peoples. Oh, wait, let me tidy up a little. Hey, guys. We are on Vancouver Island in one of my favorite, favorite, favorite places, Qualicum Beach. Look what we're doing. We're having lunch right at the beach. We're going to have some turkey and some tomatoes and red onion and Havarti cheese and Rocky Mountain blend greens on multi-grain ancient grain tortillas. It's kind of dark. $23. No, what do you mean 23? You're just making something up. Yeah, I know. Where's the quack? Oh, oh open the curtain. Oh, I so thought you walk okay. was over here. No, just open the curtain all the way. It is. No, all the way. Thank you. Uh, guac's in here. There's the guac. Guac, a guac, a guac. You want guac? I want a little bit of guac. Don't over guac me. Just well, a little guac. Guac comes out at one level. That, stop. That's lots of guac. It's kind of spicy. He got like a medium heat one, yeah. which is weird to have it. But anyways, this is where we are. Look. No, I wasn't going to yeah, show it. That's okay. good guac. Good guac. It's kind of backlit. Anyways, look where we are. I'll show you around. I'll show you around. Look at me look so dark. Did you change some weird setting again? I don't think so. You always say that to me and then I got the, the video afterwards and I can't see it. So here we are. Qualicum Beach. It is so pretty and peaceful here. And we met some subscribers. People actually came up and said they're subscribers and they watch us and that's so cool. We had a nice chat with them. They even know Chrome. <laughs> yeah, they said, oh yeah, we watch him first, but you guys were the first ones we started watching, they said. They said to us, we were the first ones they started watching when they're building out their van. They're still in the process of building out their Ford Transit. Uh, that's looking good, but um, yeah. they're just getting started and they're just going to be weekend warriors, I think, which is nothing wrong with that. Yeah. So we're, uh, Van yeah, Vancouver Island, Qualicum Beach, one of my favorite, favorite places. And we're just having some lunch. And I guess Rob's making lunch. Look at that. What a, what a change. Rob, you're making food for us? <laughs> okay. It's a rare, rare occasion. Tur oh. Turn that camera off. We've got to talk. we got to talk. Anyway. He doesn't mean it. So, yeah, what do you got on there? You, oh, oh, careful. I'll spill my bubblies. Okay, well, I better finish making mine. I'm sure it's going to be delicious. We, we like to eat like this for lunch. Yummy, yummy. Yep. And uh, we'll take you along as we head north up north on the island on the east coast because it's absolutely gorgeous here. Look at how I'm rolling that. See? Okay. Oh, and now he's going to do and, rolling tips. And I was accused oh, funny. of my youth. No, wasting don't, my time. Don't, don't, don't say, oh, don't say something that's gonna, you're gonna regret. <laughs> no, too late for that. <laughs> too late I don't even know what I'm filming. Okay. Too late We're for We're gonna that. go. There. You're gonna have your bite and we'll see. Bon appetit. Boop. Mmm. Just like my mother would have made if she was here.
is one of my favorite places. Qualicum Beach, Vancouver Island. Um, hey you. Right. There's a food truck over there. Yeah, I see that. You should check them out. I'll well, go check it out, see if there's anything. Obviously, it must be something good there. I can smell the shore, it's right in front of us. If we just hold on tight. This vision that I saw is getting closer every dawn. Ooh, we are dreamers of the shore. When we can't dream. Three. She's storming. Yeah, see, it's coming in. <laughs> I can see it over there. It doesn't look so good. We just sail with the wind that we've got. And when we're drowning in doubt, just keep on believing. We are dreamers of the So here we are at Union Bay. I've been out taking pictures. I did a time lapse. Uh, I don't know how it'll turn out. But anyway, uh, I'll just give you a little pan here because uh, there's a storm coming and uh, it's actually starting to rain right now. And I'm just uh, getting everything together and going to go into the, the uh, van and tire down for the night. So anyway, this is where we're parked for the night. And this is what is rolling in. Say good night, Janet. <laughs> oh, she's doing dishes. Okay. Look at that, it's pretty ominous. be happy how many times do you have to feel lonely before you get the chance to meet someone before you get to meet someone like you so there's a bus right there launching away he's having his breakfast while we have ours right where we're boondocking Hi, buddy. How many songs can you write about heartbreak? How to go when you're fed up with mistakes? Maybe I just found the answers. Maybe I just found the answers in you. Bad. They must love it out there, eh? They sure do. Yeah. That's so amazing. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's not on the way down. Hi. Oh my goodness. 
Hi. Oh my gosh. Now you want to say hi to this one? Sure. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Hi. Oh, the There's a little bit of trouble hi, right here. There he is. Hi there. Oh hey, my how goodness. You? Oh my gosh. It finally happened. It did. I know it's hard to believe, but it finally happened. Rob, you know what I'm going to talk about? What? <laughs> I guess not. Get ready, guys, to witness. Don't! You knew what I was going to do! Put them back on! Put your, he's wearing Crocs finally. Put your Crocs on, you jerk. How did you know? <laughs> That's what I was going to say. She? Rob is finally, finally wearing his Crocs and getting his feet wet. See, I wear my Crocs. I was barefoot until you said that. We're crocking it. Oh, this way. <laughs> We're crocking it. Look at how the water's still outflowing here. Oh, you knocked my camera. My camera. My camera. He my knocked camera. it. Look how far out we are. Cool. Wee. There's Ramona, our van, way back there. You probably can't even see her, parked back there. And we're heading out on Comox, or Kai Beach in Comox. Right, Rob? Right. This is incredible. <laughs> yeah, there's rocks out there that are moss covered. You can see her, seaweed covered. But yeah, he's doing it. Look, guys, he's wearing Crocs. Just wanted to get you to witness that because that's a rare occurrence. Right, Rob? I guess so. As you can see here, we are that far from uh, the shore. But anyway, the tide's still going out here, as witnessed by this little area in here. See, it's flowing out. And so are we. You see all the different striations of the water settling and uh, water flowing out. Very neat. And I imagine you see a lot of kids here with um, like the butterfly nets because we see a lot of uh, different things, uh, crabs and that, uh, while a lot of them are dead. Uh, they're actually pretty good size. Uh, but then there's a lot of sand crabs and things I guess here and shells and uh, all very cool and of course underneath the sand there's probably lots of stuff buried dug in and uh won't come out until the water is to a point where it's safe for them to uh, come out so anyway yeah look at this oh oh a big piece of mud uh washed in or not mud sand very firm very firm in fact uh we we were watching horses out here and they were uh, running around and uh, we saw their footprints or hoof prints as we come out and uh, they're not leaving a lot of uh, indentations. Uh, it's very firm, as you can see. It's, uh, yeah, very firm. Yeah. Anyway. It's cool. So this will all be underwater here within about uh, probably five hours. And you can see how it's humped here. Then it goes down and then comes up to the beach. So I don't imagine that when uh, the water is on the beach at the normal level, if you were out here, that there would be a heck of a lot of water underneath you. You could probably get out and uh, stand if you're in a boat. And we've never, uh, when we were here yesterday, we didn't see any motorized uh, uh, watercraft here. It was all canoes, kayaks, paddle boards. And, uh, and then when you look at that far point right there, uh, we've seen ferries come from there. Uh, uh, I think that's the, the terminal for uh, the ferries in this area. So anyway, pretty neat. Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's, uh, it's uh, The outflow is pretty good. And then all of a sudden it'll stop. And I'm getting sunken in as I, as I stand here. It's sticky more and more. Yeah, it's because of the wash. Be, you can see yeah. it they're going off of my ankles here. Yeah. Look at that. That's really neat. The mossy rocks. Yeah, there's a young lad over there. He's got a, a net, I guess they, 
They find different things in the water here in these tidal pools. Okay. I can hear it all. Everything's kind of making a noise. Between them. Whoop! It shot right on me. <laughs> oh, I can hear them underneath. They're making noises. How cool is that? I don't want to step on them. How cool is that? I have one shoot right into my into my uh, shoes. They're making like noises. <laughs> are they like a, an enemy or something? What are they? Okay, I don't know, but I think the tide's starting to come back in. Anyway, you see how there's waves here. I think it's uh, starting to come back in. That's beautiful. Huh? It is. It says it's filming. It says it's filming? I think it is. That's it's good. a red dot. Okay. <laughs> so here we are. This is Rath Trevor Beach, Rath Trevor Provincial Park. We're contemplating spending a couple of nights here, which we haven't done that in a very long time. Something just landed on me and passed away. Ooh. Anyways, uh, apart from that, we haven't done staying overnight in campsites yet, but we're gonna try it. We'll see if we can get in here or Little Qualcomm Falls. So have a look around. It's beautiful. Lights out. What'd you say, Rob? Said the tide is out. The tide is out. I think it comes back in around five o'clock. And there's snow-capped mountains out there. It's pretty here, but I have to say, I remember it being beautiful here. But I think I still prefer Qualicum Beach myself personally. Um, this is a little bit more expansive and grassy and treed, 
but um, there's a lot of people here. It's a hot sunny day and I think that's maybe part of it too. We, I like more of the rustic beaches where it's not a place you sit in the sand but more just explore, yeah. right? Yeah, everywhere we've gone today has been very uh, uh, full of uh, people for the begin or middle of the week. It's uh, yeah, cathedral, it's Wednesday. Cathedral Grove, uh, any of the Cameron uh, Lake. Every everywhere that's touristy is packed today. Yeah. So maybe people are getting their last uh, licks of summer in, <laughs> I guess. But um, we'll just uh, give you another look around here, and then we're gonna see where we end up. We're not sure. Yeah. All right. And nothing's gonna hold us down. We are taking off the ground